COVID-19 Coronavirus Disease 2019, COVID-19, is a contagious disease caused by a virus, the Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome Coronavirus 2, SARS-CoV-2. The first known case was identified in Wuhan, China, in December 2019. The disease quickly spread worldwide, resulting in the COVID-19 pandemic. The Topic, COVID-19, in Overview Coronavirus Coronaviruses are a group of related RNA viruses that cause diseases in mammals and birds. In humans and birds, they cause respiratory tract infections that can range from mild to lethal. Mild illnesses in humans include some cases of the common cold, which is also caused by other viruses, predominantly rhinoviruses, while more lethal varieties can cause SARS, MERS, and COVID-19, which is causing an ongoing pandemic. The Topic Coronavirus in Overview Coronavirus Spike Protein Spike, S, glycoprotein, sometimes also called spike protein, formerly known as E2, is the largest of the four major structural proteins found in coronaviruses. The spike protein assembles into trimmers that form large structures, called spikes or peplomers, that project from the surface of the virion. Infection an infection is the invasion of tissues by pathogens, their multiplication, and the reaction of host tissues to the infectious agent and the toxins they produce. An infectious disease, also known as a transmissible disease or communicable disease, is an illness resulting from an infection. The Topic Infection in Overview Mink Mink are dark-colored, semi-aquatic, carnivorous mammals of the genera Neogal and Mustla and part of the family Mustlidae, which also includes weasels, otters, and ferrets. There are two extant species referred to as mink, the American mink and the European mink. The extinct sea mink is related to the American mink but was much larger. The American mink's fur has been highly prized for use in clothing. Blood, brain barrier. The blood, brain barrier, BBB, is a highly selective semi-permeable border of endothelial cells that prevents solutes in the circulating blood from non-selectively crossing into the extracellular fluid of the central nervous system where neurons reside. The blood-brain barrier is formed by endothelial cells of the capillary wall, astrocyte end feet in sheathing the capillary, and pericytes embedded in the capillary basement membrane. Mortality rate Mortality rate, or death rate, 189 69 is a measure of the number of deaths, in general, or due to a specific cause, in a particular population, scaled to the size of that population, per unit of time. Mortality rate is typically expressed in units of deaths per 1,000 individuals per year, thus, a mortality rate of 9.5, out of 1,000, in a population of 1,000 would mean 9.5 deaths per year in that entire population, or 0.95% out of the total. The Topic, Mortality Rate, in Overview Centers for Disease Control and Prevention The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, is the National Public Health Agency of the United States. It is a United States federal agency, under the Department of Health and Human Services, and is headquartered in Atlanta, Georgia. The agency's main goal is the protection of public health and safety through the control and prevention of disease, injury, and disability in the U.S. and worldwide. Virus A virus is a submicroscopic infectious agent that replicates only inside the living cells of an organism. Viruses infect all life forms, from animals and plants to microorganisms, including bacteria and archaea. The Topic Virus in Overview Wuhan Wuhan, U.S. also, simplified Chinese, traditional Chinese, pinyin, Wuhan, Yudutzan, listen, is the capital of Hubei province in the People's Republic of China. It is the largest city in Hubei and the most populous city in central China, with a population of over 11 million, the ninth most populous Chinese city. The Topic Wuhan in Overview Pandemic A pandemic, from Greek Pinu, Pan, all and Delta Mu Omicron, Demos, local people, the crowd, is an epidemic of an infectious disease that has spread across a large region, for instance multiple continents or worldwide, affecting a substantial number of individuals. A widespread endemic disease with a stable number of infected individuals is not a pandemic. Pneumonia 
Pneumonia is an inflammatory condition of the lung primarily affecting the small air sacs known as alveoli. Symptoms typically include some combination of productive or dry cough, chest pain, fever, and difficulty breathing. The severity of the condition is variable. Pneumonia is usually caused by infection with viruses or bacteria, and less commonly by other microorganisms. Antibody An antibody, IB, also known as an immunoglobulin, Ig, is a large, Y-shaped protein used by the immune system to identify and neutralize foreign objects such as pathogenic bacteria and viruses. The antibody recognizes a unique molecule of the pathogen, called an antigen. Each tip of the Y of an antibody contains a paratope, analogous to a lock, that is specific for one particular epitope, analogous to a key, on an antigen, allowing these two structures to bind together with precision. The Topic Antibody in Overview Dexamethasone Dexamethasone is a glucocorticoid medication used to treat rheumatic problems, a number of skin diseases, severe allergies, asthma, chronic obstructive lung disease, croup, brain swelling, eye pain following eye surgery, superior vena cava syndrome, a complication of some forms of cancer, and along with antibiotics and tuberculosis. Angiotensin Converting Enzyme 2 Angiotensin Converting Enzyme 2, ACE2, is an enzyme that can be found either attached to the membrane of cells, MACE2, in the intestines, kidney, testis, gallbladder, and heart or in a soluble form, SACE2. Both membrane-bound and soluble ACE2 are integral parts of the renin, angiotensin, aldosterone system, RAAS, that exists to keep the body's blood pressure in check. Myxomatosis Myxomatosis is a disease caused by myxoma virus, a poxirus in the genus Leporipoxirus. The natural hosts are Topidae, Silvilagus brasiliensis, in South and Central America, and brush rabbits, Silvilagus bachmani, in North America. The myxoma virus causes only a mild disease in these species, but causes a severe and usually fatal disease in European rabbits, Oryctolagus cuniculus. Nasopharyngeal swab A nasopharyngeal swab is a device used for collecting a sample of nasal secretions from the back of the nose and throat. The sample is then analyzed for the presence of organisms or other clinical markers for disease. This diagnostic method is commonly used in suspected cases of whooping cough, diphtheria, influenza, and various types of diseases caused by the coronavirus family of viruses, including SARS, MERS, and COVID-19. Procedure to collect the sample, the swab is inserted in the nostril and gently or harshly, experience varies depending on the person doing the procedure, moved forward into the nasopharynx, a region of the pharynx that covers the roof of the mouth. Genome in the fields of molecular biology and genetics, a genome is all genetic information of an organism. It consists of nucleotide sequences of DNA, or RNA in RNA viruses. The nuclear genome includes protein-coding genes and non-coding genes, the other functional regions of the genome, see non-coding DNA, and any junk DNA if it is present. Protein Proteins are large biomolecules and macromolecules that comprise one or more long chains of amino acid residues. Proteins perform a vast array of functions within organisms, including catalysing metabolic reactions, DNA replication, responding to stimuli, providing structure to cells and organisms, and transporting molecules from one location to another. Respiratory system The respiratory system, also respiratory apparatus, ventilatory system, is a biological system consisting of specific organs and structures used for gas exchange in animals and plants. The anatomy and physiology that make this happen varies greatly, depending on the size of the organism, the environment in which it lives and its evolutionary history. Reverse transcription polymerase chain reaction Reverse transcription polymerase chain reaction, RT-PCR, is a laboratory technique combining reverse transcription of RNA into DNA in this context called complementary DNA or cDNA, an amplification of specific DNA targets using polymerase chain reaction, PCR. It is primarily used to measure the amount of a specific RNA. Intensive care medicine Intensive care medicine, also called critical care medicine, is a medical specialty that deals with seriously or critically ill patients who have, are at risk of, or are recovering from conditions that may be life-threatening. It includes providing life support, 
invasive monitoring techniques, resuscitation, and end-of-life care. SARS-CoV-2 Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome Coronavirus 2, SARS-CoV-2, is a strain of coronavirus that causes COVID-19, coronavirus disease 2019, the respiratory illness responsible for the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. The virus previously had a provisional name, 2019 Novel Coronavirus, 2019 NCoV, and has also been called Human Coronavirus 2019, HCoV-19 or HCoV-19. The topic, SARS-CoV-2, in overview. Symptoms. Symptoms of COVID-19 are variable, but often include fever, cough, headache, fatigue, breathing difficulties, loss of smell, and loss of taste. The topic symptoms in overview. Asymptomatic. In medicine, any disease is classified asymptomatic if a patient tests as carrier for a disease or infection but experiences no symptoms. Whenever a medical condition fails to show noticeable symptoms after a diagnosis it might be considered asymptomatic. Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome, ARDS, is a type of respiratory failure characterized by rapid onset of widespread inflammation in the lungs. Symptoms include shortness of breath, dyspnea, rapid breathing, tachypnea, and bluish skin coloration, cyanosis. For those who survive, a decreased quality of life is common. Cytokine Storm A cytokine storm also called hypercytokinemia, is a physiological reaction in humans and other animals in which the innate immune system causes an uncontrolled and excessive release of pro-inflammatory signaling molecules called cytokines. Normally, cytokines are part of the body's immune response to infection, but their sudden release in large quantities can cause multi-system organ failure and death.